So we're here at Best Buy getting batteries again. We have to get batteries for every show. And going up. Now we're on the roof. So awesome. Yeah. How often do you get to go on the roof of the store you're going into? Not very. Twice in my lifetime. And it's, it was the same store both times. This one. This being the second time. Still get batteries. A couple days ago, both of these were completely full of 9 volts. But we get like this many every day, so it, it's there's not many 9 volts left. What's funny? Let's go and get in line. Oh, hi. There you are over there, Scott. Yep. I see you. Yours plugs into 13. Okay. And mine plugs into 14. I have to go over there. They're doing a special performance. And they don't have enough microphones, so I'm running speakers. No, microphones on the stage. But we didn't have any, so I have to put them. So we put two. Here's one wire. There's one over there. So, where's the end? There's the end. Right there. I have to take this and run it back to my snake. They're at the very front of the stage. Time to go back over there. Once this gets untangled. Okay. Going back. To the back stage. The grass is really deep here. Okay, here we go. And this will plug into 14. Good. Where did you go, Scott? I'm untangling this horrible mess. Oh, okay. These are all used batteries. This isn't all of them, this is just some of the ones I've collected that we have to get for every show. And they're about four dollars a piece. It adds up pretty quickly. It's a lot of batteries I have to buy. But the show has to go on, so we have to get them every time. Energizer. Look, some of these have discolored. You can tell. See, it's kind of golden, and this side is more copper. Gold. Copper. Gold. Yeah. Well, they're not equity actors. It's fine. That's true. Okay, so we're doing a a uh, pre-performance before our actual show, so we have to set up extra early. It's super windy, but if you look over here at the CD player, here runs my <laughs> It says no disc. Which was the last that gave King Henry life. So we're an hour away from my house, and that's where the CDs are for the show, and the show starts in an hour. It's gonna be really close, but my mom's coming with the CDs, so hopefully she gets here on time, and we can start the show at the correct time. Oops, that's my fault. I forgot to bring it. Sorry. So the show went good. It was a few minutes late, but we, my mom was like running up, ah, here's the CDs, like, at 2.33. Supposed to go at 2:30, but it was fine. And then, and then, the intercom system wasn't working. She's like, "Why is this not working?" I said, "I'll figure it out." So the pre-show speech is going. It's only two minutes. I have to figure out why the intercom's not working. And then, oh, that would have been bad. So and then, uh, 
Yeah, I was going to fix it. I accidentally stepped on the plug, like this, and I pulled out the power to the amplifiers. So the pre-show speech kind of stopped and only came out of those four for a few minutes, and then I plugged it back in. And then it was all fixed. What about the intercom? It was fixed as soon as I plugged it in. Anyway, show's over, and it's all caution taped, and we can't get out. So we have to get out. <laughs> I got out. Yeah. Scott Stern. Let's go tackle Eddie. <laughs> you can go tackle him, I'll film. I got him. We are at A and W again. French fries, burger. Mmm, that's really good. Really. So good. This is like our Sunday place. So if you're ever in, um, where are we? I don't know where we are. If you're ever here, if you're ever here, you should visit us at the A and W. Along 101, just north of San Francisco. Not just north. The first A and W you come to from the Golden Gate Bridge going north. That's where we are. At about this time. What time is it? At about seven o'clock. Yeah. Visit us. More fuel. <laughs> 